Hello, welcome to another Dying Light 2 video. This is again in game plus mode. We're getting to our very first point of turning one of the regions to a faction by taking over this water tower. We get to decide who gets it, whether it goes to the people or to the PK. You will be given the task of disarming the water tower from Jack and Joe from a different person, depending upon what pathway you took through the Tango Motel and other tasks. I chose not to trust anybody, which meant that the PK gave me the assignment to go take this over. I've already decided I'm assigning all of Old Villador to the PK. The reason I'm doing that is that when you get four zones assigned to the PK, you get the crossbow, which is a awesome weapon and what is very useful to have going forward. So what I will do is give both of these regions to the PK. And after we finish the rest of the storyline, we'll be heading into the new area. And then we will begin to turn these over as well. But anyway, so here is the water tower in case you're either coming from... the bazaar or coming from the PK what we need to do is disarm this and climb to the top and try very hard not to uh, fall I have cleared out everybody around here just so that we have a chance to talk about what we're doing you want to come in disarm the explosive follow the yellow markers as all of dying light likes to tell us to do just to see what it looks like so I've dropped down ladders but just to keep things <coughs> an instruction we are going to climb around pretty easily <coughs> simple jumps from one to the next nothing all that powerful platforming swinging again here is the ladder that I dropped down earlier that if I do fall, I can get up easily. There's a door here. We want to break through that door. Disarm these explosives. Turn our lights on so we can see where we're going. We want to climb up the tubes. Get out that door. If you've got the parkour skills, you can just jump up there. If you don't have the park course go to do that with it's a simple job of jumping over right there a couple of simple jumps there's a ladder here I went ahead and already dropped that ladder down but again anytime you see a ladder drop it down we can hear Jack talking Jack and Jack talking they'll get what they deserve they will die. Jack, I'm warning you. One more explosion in here. Got it. Now we gotta go. And the water it. is safe. If you come through here the first time in normal mode, you'll get some inhibitors. Oh been through this in game plus we do not get the inhibitors back again we have to go use new ones open the door need to get up some more very careful oh this is the way we came in sorry there we go up here if you have the skills you can jump over or you can grab a hold there. Just want to jump over. Jump over again. But again, if you don't have the skill level, you can just sort of swing around. I don't believe 
there's anything stored in any of the, uh, oh, there's always something. I doubt it's anything that important, but let's go ahead and just... A couple of things might help us in the future, or so. Let's head out. Oh, I love cage jumps. Yeah! easier because it swings nice freely. Draw. There's some that we'll run to in the future that are not as easy to swing off of. But this one, once we hit it, is doing a good job of carrying us over. Just take and turn and face the building. You made your choice, fuckers! Jack and Joan here arguing about whether to blow it up or not. So we just need to talk them out of it, even though they don't have any explosives. Either the bizarre jag holes or the PK. They'll be on us the moment we come down from here, buddy. Fuck, we lost it, man. We lost it. We can't fight everyone. That's why it's time for fireworks. Nobody's we can fight these guys, or you can talk Joe, them out I of it. Die, I talk asshole. them out of it because I get to see them again in the future, and they give me a couple of Who's quests. There? Stop! Or we'll blow the goddamn tower, I swear! I I'll found the bombs. Let's talk. The time for talking is over. We're gonna fuck this place up. You're not listening. You're done. I want it to be over. And to leave the city safely. I help me, and I'll help you. You're fooling yourself, Jack. Nobody's letting us out of here alive. Look, I am a pilgrim. Let's just blow it up already. I dare you. I know you won't do it. Don't listen to him, Jack. It's over. Fuck it up! I don't know. I'm scared. Joe, wait. Joe, hey, isn't that the pilgrim who showed up at the bazaar recently? Maybe. Pilgrim or Pope? So what? Don't you get it? If he's a pilgrim, he can get us out. Lead us out of the city to someplace safe. I don't trust that fucker. You don't trust anyone! I told you to play nice with Barney when we had the chance! Fucking listen to me for once! Well, play nice with Barney? What for? To make him get the fuck out of the bazaar! After what we found out from the peacekeepers. We tipped off the fucker, gave him a chance to run. But he thought he was too clever for that. They warned Barney. About what? Well, about Luke is wanting to take him in on weapons charges, among others. But set a trap for him for weeks. And instead of politely getting the fuck out of here, he tried to play cute instead. So, Barney knew Lucas was after him. The moron wanted to start a war in old Villador. And you ask me, war's the last thing we need. Money, crystals, that's a different story. That's why I tried to put an end to that rabbit dog and his sister. So, Pilgrim, will you get us out of the city or what? Calm down, Joe. I won't fucking calm down. Get us out of the city, Pilgrim. To the nearest safe settlement. And no one will die here. I can well, get you out of town. Or an but first, I have my own business to take care of. You need to hide somewhere and wait. Sounds like a huge risk. No risk, no gain. He's lying, Jack. There's no other way. Fuck! I don't like it. I fucking don't. But okay. We'll be waiting for you in the tunnels near the Tango Motel. We'll give you a signal when we get there. Good choice. Now give me the detonator, Jack. It's always good to have friends when you're going to battle with the infected. And they'll turn up again, like I said. So now what we got to do is to get it all flowing, but again, before we do that, See what all we can scavenge. Fighting weapons. That's about it. Uh, stuff we can sell or use if you're just starting out in the game. You may use some of these weapons. I don't. 
what we have now. So here we're going to turn on the water and activate the facility and the All right, so what now, Aiden? Smart guy. Who gets control of the water? No matter which path you take to get to this point, you still get to the side. Using the left joystick, you can go to one side or the other. Peacekeepers give me car traps. Spires give me zip lines. Like I said, you see here that when you have four, you get the crossbow. Through this way, you don't really get too much of anything. So let's go ahead and let the peacekeepers have it. Make the survivors mad. We go on from there. It's become a safe place. Everything that we found in this area also becomes a PK safe place. And we're done with this step for another challenge. I hope this helped you get your way up, figuring out what to do. Please subscribe. Let me know in the comments if you help seeing anything else, finding out how other things work. Otherwise, I will continue along the story. Have a great day.